Well, good morning, everyone, or good afternoon, I guess, actually. Um, it's Michelle from Michelle Zink at Stamp It, and today I have my finished book that I will be showing you. So um, it is uh, a Genevieve template called Stack the Pages, and uh, I, I love it. It's really cute. Um, it is... Uh, just, it is a um, small mini album. It measures, uh, let's see here, five by six and a half. And I just love it. It's so cute. So the paper that I used is uh, Bird Waltz. I purchased it at It's All About the Scrapbook. I'll link that below. I'll love. I'll link uh, Genevieve's uh, stack the pages uh, down below as well. And um, this is some lace I showed in a video yesterday that I got uh, from My Daisy Two Thousand, and some sari silk that I purchased on Amazon. And I'll put all the links below. The butterflies I did um, every day at 11.45. I do a go live on my Facebook page, Michelle Zingit Stamp It. And I showed you how to make uh, print them cuts with the Cricut and then cut them out. And then this one, uh, you can see that it's shiny now. I used my art glitter glue and I covered the whole thing with the art glitter glue and let it dry so now it's a little bit uh, not as delicate as it was so you could see the little antennae of the butterfly here and the tails the swallow tail tails <laughs> I guess that's what you would call it all right so here we go no oh, here's my um, the front I did uh, one of the little card cutouts that's in the book or in the paper pack this is a little envelope um, from Genevieve's uh, set number one, I think, um, of the mini envelopes and tags. So this is one of the littlest ones, little envelopes. I didn't, I, um, I didn't make it so it would open up, but there's uh, several different um, sizes that you can make. And it has all the little inserts for them and everything in it. So cute. So I printed, I had the, printed up the vintage doily. So when you, uh, it's pretty bright in here, I think. Can't see it, the doily really well, but there's a doily pattern on it. Really cute. Um, I did seal this one shut. So here we go. All right. So on the inside, I just um, followed along with her video and made mine. Um, the girls that I travel with, we always put three birds somewhere in something that we do that we travel with. Um, so I will probably use this for some, some of the places that we've gone. We've been to France and Italy and Austria and Germany and um, several places together. So, and we travel around the United States together too, just having a good old time. So, this is an, one of the inserts that you can print up. And this uh, Blue Fern Studios is this paper and it's uh, bird waltz. And this lace that looks like it's on it looks real. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, and they have some beautiful laces. I've, I got mine, I did a whole video on my haul from It's All About the Scrapbook, and I purchased these laces. This is pictured on the paper. It comes that way. So I have that. This was um, one of the free printables I got um, from... Uh, my printable junk journals um, page that I follow on Facebook. So thank you, Paulette, for that. This is a um, Genevieve uh, photo mat. 
and I've adhered it. This is printed up in the collage too. This is a Tim Holtz mini paperclip. And this is another one of the um, photo mats from the basically amazing photo mats from Genevieve. I scoot that over just a little bit so you can see it all. So, and then this, the blue in this, I, it doesn't show up in the camera well, but it is, oh, it's just something. So this comes off if you want to take it off because the paper's so pretty, I just didn't want to cover it up. There are three pocket pages for inserts, you know, little file folder inserts that you can, they should fit a, um, let's see if I have one here, a four by six photo would fit perfectly on them. So you could do four photos there. that just goes back in the tab is from her um, from the stack the pages this is a pull out go this way with it here whoops caught on my butterfly I'm sure so another flip out page I had intended to make this as a pocket page um, and I glued the whole thing down of course <laughs> so yeah that's the way that goes um, this is a little envelope that comes with it. It has a little insert. And then I use the belly band to hold it up. And I placed a butterfly from the print and cuts that we did. And I could scoot this over so it goes underneath the butterfly wings and that holds it down. This is some lace that my sister-in-law gave me. So I cut out this flower and attached it to one of the um, cards, the journaling cards that are in the package. It doesn't come with any ephemera, but it does come with a page of uh, um, journaling cards. And they're, they're all small ones, they're no large ones. So this is one of the tags. Um, and this is printed up with the bird song on it. I mean with the music notes, sorry, over the top of it. So that's there. And I like that rose to stay up on the top. And I put sorry silk. This is one of the three um, from the free printables from Paulette from the printable junk journals. Um, group that I belong to on Facebook and this is some crochet twine that I got on um, Amazon So those can go in there Then this is a little uh, notebook under the belly band and I don't have anything in it. So it's just but I did print the um, Music note over the top of this one for the template and then this is one of the um, butterflies that we made in our printables uh, on my Facebook page. And this is one of the journaling cards and I just put it down as a pocket because it has the small pocket in the front. This is one of the journaling cards that comes with it. I'll turn this into a tag. Um, I just haven't done that yet. And then this is one of the envelopes. This is one of the cards. Uh, this is one of the envelopes from the stack, your, um, stack the Pages. This is one of the journaling cards from the Bird Waltz. This is also one of the cards from the Bird Waltz. So I just uh, had to trim it up just a little bit to put it in. This one I just folded up and stuck inside there. And... Um, this pocket here. So I adhered that um, card. Part of it uh, got cut off when I was doing something that I used the other side for. So I just glued the three sides down. And it fit perfectly on there. Sorry, that's my dog walking around on the floor. <laughs> Little nails. Um, then this is a printable that we made also on my Facebook page uh, on the Cricut. This is Genevieve's uh, Shades of Color 
I printed on one side and then I did the print and cut on the other side with the um, Cricut and uh, sized it to fit perfectly in here and it works great it sticks up just the right amount and then this is just a um, plain page and a pull out oh I was gonna I got a note to myself to put a pocket there this has a pocket on the back um, with another file folder that these will all hold four by sixes so and then on this side on my um, uh, go live that I do on Facebook as well we made this little paper clip uh, with the banner and this was a circle that came out from we made these little purse things on there and um, so this was a circle that got cut out of there so it was sitting on my desk so got to use it and then this is one of the um, printables from Genevieve uh, stack your pa stack the pages this is one of the little inserts so I just tuck that under there uh, this is some of the lace that I got and some of the sari silk I put underneath there this is um, pull all this stuff out this is a little pocket page this is an insert to one of the envelopes but I just scored it and put it on there to make a little flap on here and I didn't even get close to putting it in the center <laughs> I don't know what I was doing but again that lace look at that how gorgeous that is so this is um, more paper from the bird waltz and I printed the music notes over the top of it for the printable uh, again, sorry, silk. Um, these are whole reinforcers. I get a plain and then I color them, whatever color I need them, and use them on my tags. Um, this is the third printable, the free printable that comes um, um, from the the free the, the free Friday freebies that she does. This is one of the little inserts to um, one of the little envelopes that comes with the stack the pages another little insert here it goes into the envelope but I just put it in there this is uh, supposed to be a label uh, you can use it and cut um, do the edges for a, a tab or um, you could put it on the side and put a little mat on it for a little tuck spot I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet so I just put it in there for now so when I fussy cut this flower out on the front here and um, adhered it, this was the strip of paper that I had left. And I cut, fussy cut the flower from out here, so I just cut this off. And it was the perfect size to make a little tag, so I uh, used my corner chopper and did the corners up at the top. I used my corner rounder, did the, rounded the edges, and then I put a little bit of the same lace that was on the front here uh, on the top of this tag. There was one little piece that I had to cut off on the other part, so I just shoved it up underneath there so that has sorry silk and the lace in there. And then I let the lace just come down and stick out over that pocket. I think that's really cute. I love how that turned out. This is just a plain page. Um, this is another uh, of Genevieve's uh, basically amazing photo mats. So I put on here with another Tim Holtz uh, little clip. And this is the collage too. And let's see if I can open this up here. This is just the regular collage. So it doesn't have the little different colors in it. Uh, like this does. This has like a green and some purples and different colors in it. So that's that. And then this is another pocket here. And I have the file folder in it. So that goes in the center there. And then this is one of the envelopes. So I think there's either three or four different sizes of the envelopes. 
and then this is one of the insert that goes in the envelope. So there's that. Put that in there. Fits perfectly in the pocket. I didn't put a closure on it. I haven't put anything on the back yet, but sometimes you know you just gotta wait a bit to see what you want to do with it. And then this uh, card was one of the journaling cards, and I just put um, wanted to use it like uh, this book belongs to, or um, you know, handmade for you by me, uh, with love, whatever, whatever you want to do. And I thought, well, I'll just put that there because that's nice for a little book plate thing. And I'll probably put a pocket or something on the inside in here. I just haven't decided. You could also just put a full 4x6 photo in there. Um, and I might just put a pocket in there and put a bunch of these in there so that you can use them however you want. Okay. That is it for the bird song book. Um, stack the pages. And uh, so you take care, stay safe, and I'll talk to you later. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll put uh, other videos over here that you might enjoy. Thank you for stopping by.